While lead poisoning of wildlife is a huge issue, it's one we can fix. And there are specific things that you can do. If you happen to be a hunter, the most obvious thing, make the switch to non-lead ammunition. Look for it, find it, don't wait till the last minute because sometimes it's not available locally, but making that switch is a statement that you are an ethical conservationist. If you happen to be one of those folks that simply will not make the switch to non-lead ammunition, or maybe you just can't find it locally, you can still reduce the risk that your lead bullet will indeed poison a bald eagle or other wildlife. Simply bury that gut pile or cover it with brush where avian scavengers can't find it and can't get to it. That helps a lot. If you don't happen to be a hunter yourself, but you perhaps have friends or family who are, you can give the gift of non-lead ammunition in the same caliber and bullet weight that they might normally use and remove the excuse that they have to avoid trying the new ammunition. Change is hard for a lot of people, but that gift will be perfect to encourage the change and save the life of an eagle. Certainly one of the best things you can do with any environmental issue is to become informed, understand the issue, and be able to explain it to others. You can find information on the lead intoxication of raptors and other wildlife at the Wildlife Center of Virginia's website or at many other locations across the internet. Gather the information and share it. A little bit of effort will enable us to fix this problem, conserve our wildlife, and make the future better for all of us.